checkmate me here. Okay, I was gonna say. <laughs> you your your ancestors will weep. Alright. Awesome. Very good game, sir. I mean, I'm not gonna say I played very well. I don't think I played horribly, but I definitely made some oh six blunders. Fuck. Maybe I did play that poorly. I think you definitely had a missed win a couple times. Yeah, even a poor plan is better than no plan at all. I had no fucking plan. So. Uh, 81% accuracy is okay. I had one blunder. I know the blunder. You had a great move. You had a shitload of best moves. And one miss. Yeah, pretty sure. Uh, I know where the miss was. I think your when your queen was almost in the back row, you could have just taken it out. Okay, so here we go. I should learn the Grunfeld. Grunfeld. I just fucking, I don't know. I don't know what it is. Mm, interesting. <clears throat> okay, I didn't hit go. This is one thing with chess.com that I don't like. Like, it's just playing the game for me. Like, all those moves, I didn't hit anything. It just played them, played them, played them. And this is something that, this is one of my criticisms of chess.com. The, da the dashboard, Lord. the desktop version is, f okay, it's a great application. So I code, uh, specifically I, I, I code applications. This is a complicated application. Um, the, the phone version, the phone app is so much superior. Like it's just, it's, it's such a better user experience. All right. I'm going to go back because fuck all of that shit. I'm going to come back to here and actually look at our moves. Uh, I think with the increments, this is a good game time management for me, from, <clears throat> from you. I appreciate that. Time management was better on this with the increment. Uh, without an increment, I'm fucking... <clears throat> I'm better when I have time to fucking think, as is everybody. Interesting. It wants me to just strike out. It's like, just fucking go for it. Hmm. It really likes your move. I ignored an opportunity to strike the center with a pawn. I think that's... I didn't know what else to do. I was like, well, I'm going to get my pieces involved instead of pushing pawns. It would have been better. There would have been a take. But now what? So what happens after that take? Let's see. <clears throat> I guess the castle makes sense because if you take... And you don't castle. Um, like instead, like I move here. If you push, like... I think this is good. Like I'm getting more of a center. Maybe. I don't know. That looks kind of weird. Like I don't know what else I would do if you pushed, right? See what it says. Yeah, B kills C. Right. It it was like, well, I don't know about that. I'm just not sure. It's like, go fuck yourself, fucking engine, you piece of shit. Yeah, so you would take, ignore it, and castle. <clears throat> All right, so that's not what happened. I did this. It's an inaccuracy. Whatever. Inaccuracy. Schminaccuracy. So, Balbir, it wanted you to take instead. I guess the take keeps things... You've got an attacker there, and it keeps all the centralized, maybe? Why is this take better? It really wants that, and now it wants me to kill here. It takes your center pawn away. Well, then why didn't you do it? 
<laughs> Come on, Balbir. What the fuck? Fair. Fair enough. Takes my center point away. All right, so that's what it is. And it's better to... Because normally, the, like, the Sicilian gives up the C pawn, the flank pawn, not the, the center pawn. Development, right. Well, you're developing these guys. I mean, I'm not arguing with you. You won the game. <laughs> <clears throat> but I'm going to be, you know, smarmy. <clears throat> Excuse me. Okay, so you come here. It hates this. It really wants me to break the rule of getting this out of Dodge. I didn't have a plan. Um, I was trying to develop kind of blindly, making making sure that my uh, my pieces were coordinated at least together. And a lot of the, the headspace that I was in, other than up my ass, was I've been reading this book that one of my uh, Hail Hydrate, one of the subscribers, uh, I think it's who knows or cares sent me and I'll tell you what the, what the book is. <clears throat> if I'm wrong about that, then, you know, I'm wrong. It is how to reassess your chess fourth edition by Jeremy Silman. That's one of the books I'm going to go through on the Patreon, um, the secret Patreon live streams. Anyway, uh, one of the things that it talks about in the beginning is imbalance. And specifically training you how to see imbalances. So what I was trying to figure out is we were pretty equal throughout the game. <clears throat> um, who had the better pieces? You know, what was the better position type thing? All right, so it wants that instead. Man, look at this blunder. We were actually pretty even until I blundered it. This activates the knight by, develop <clears throat> by developing it off its natural square. Hold on a second. Let me get some more wine. I can't fucking talk. I blame California weather. Someone lied to me. They said California weather was always the same. It was warm and sunny. It's not true. It's not true. You guys actually do have weather out here. It's not as bad as Kentucky, but all right. Yes, it activates the knight. Ignored an opportunity to develop the knight. That's why. That's why this is an inaccuracy. Let's see what it does. Okay, so it supports this pawn push. And it doesn't block the queen. It's interesting how these rules that I've learned, like never push the F pawn, <clears throat> never put the knight on the square, can get in the way. All right, we're going to continue. Um, that is not where we went. We did this. Okay. Also, why is my computer running like a biatch? Or like a dick. We won't misgender. Okay, it likes this. I think the A A5 would have been a good push. Just gain space. Because um, that's what we were doing. Yep. Fianchetto, you had all the best. Taking is excellent. It wants you to activate your rook and just build up the tension. Take, take. Excellent. It wants you to put the other rook on. Might as well just laser the queen. I was waiting for that for a long time, um, which you eventually did, of course. Okay. It wants me to move my queen. Uh, I eventually do this. I was a little bit afraid of that move. So I was guarding my knight is, is the reason that I did that. Best move. Nice. Okay, takes. 
Developing the knight first. Okay, so this is just my tactical brain not working. I did think about this at length. Uh, two minutes almost. Well, a minute and a half. Yeah, waiting till you got the queen there was a, was a bad move. That was bad. Okay, let me get to this point here. It really likes this knight out. And let's find out why. Hmm. <clears throat> Isolated center pawn. I mean, you're 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 up at this point a little bit. Uh, half a pawn. But the pawn is supporting this guy. This guy is supporting this guy. Yeah, the pieces are, are working together. I mean, I see like, you know, a weird check, sure. That's a nice, funky square. Hmm. And it's kind of hard to get at this guy. Like, you want to move this, right? Maybe there, something like that. Let's look. What are what are the next moves? Knight kills e4. Hmm. So just get rid of this and break this down. And then e5. Uh, boom. <clears throat> Starting the attack. Okay. Right on. <coughs> Excuse me. Okay, we'll come back. Uh, it's dubious. It's dubious. I was afraid of this move, this this exchange here, which is why I didn't do it. All right, so we move, do all this. You take its best. Not a great move. This is what I did instead. Activating the queen, connecting the rooks is the best move here. Also, bolstering this guy. My idea was to get this dude in the game this way, or in the game this way. Probably wouldn't have worked, because that would have sort of canceled it. Or, to push here. Because this knight, basically just pushing the knight somewhere else. Hmm. Okay. Queen moves, great. It does not like this. It relinquishes the defender of the knight. Okay. Huh. Interesting. So here's your inaccuracy. It wants... This guy. I wonder if it'll tell me why. Ignores the opportunity to offer an equal trade of pieces. So basically just break down my position. <clears throat> no, that's not what I wanted to do. You son of a bitch. Okay, so it's only going to do it on my side. Um, it wants that. So just more and more and more tension. Yeah, so I can't take... You just block that shit off. And you're attacking this just in case you wanted to. Or opening up for something like that. I'm assuming you wanted to keep this bishop. Alright. Coming back over here. A mistake. Should have just taken. I was trying to reroute this knight. No, I was trying to protect this square right here. Because what I saw was something like that. So had I not rerouted, I guess, duh, I could have taken, boom, and then come here. I was worried about this attack on the queen, which was actually an attack on the rook, 
which was actually potentially a back, uh, back row mate. So once e8, knight e8. Oh, so keep the defender. Do this. I'm defending that square and that square. It's pretty sexy. And it means that I didn't have to do this stupid move over here. Hmm. Yeah, I didn't even think about moving this knight. It wants bishop kills g7. Yeah, king can't take, but the knight can. I'm assuming the knight takes, of course. Um, and we're in this nice little shingmajig. Huh, interesting. All right. <clears throat> so that's... Is that what happened? Yeah, that is what happened. Boom, boom. I come here. This is a miss. So you're trying to break this down and get the checkmate. But I did have this move once you move the pawn too far. Right, me moving this knight allows you that tempo. And essentially ensures this space over here, I think. Let's play through that. So you take. I would likely take here. Yep. Yeah. Maybe here. And then you just own it. No. Knight C to D2. Huh. Oh, attacking this and breaking down my position. Because now I don't have the defender. Yeah. Okay. So if you were methodical, and I think Balbir would be, this is just <coughs> it's a bad situation. You, were, you weren't sure about the G4 pawn push. Yeah. So this is what it's looking at. Basically, you just had this huge attack, and because I gave you this move, you could reroute, kick my guys, and you know the bishop just doesn't have a good place to go when you have this attack coming. And if that fails, you have this. So this is a pretty big miss. Interesting lesson. Don't give up the defenders. Like, this is a huge moment. I saw... Could have come this way. It wants you to start tearing down the position and getting rid of this this nasty bishop opening this shit up. Okay. Keep on going. I move there. Again, I I relinquish this. <clears throat> it has a defender here, but not really cuz this is fucking gnarl. 2 2 2 like that. Okay. So it's a miss. Take, takes, back here, takes. Instead, it really wants you to get rid of this guy. So this bishop uh, was a plague upon your house. Takes, great, come here. Interesting, it wants that. Just more squares to, uh, uh, to rock and roll with. Ooh. So don't take, you've got loads of, of guys. And right now we're actually even, or pretty even. Put the pressure on. Expand on the king side. Interesting. Because now, I guess I just don't have an attack on you. And all your shit is focused. And mine's not doing anything. Like, where the fuck is this guy going? <laughs> like, if I come out this way, you know, there's the sacrifice, but this starts coming down. Hmm. Yeah, it opens up your king. Your queen can jolly foot around, whatever the fuck. 
Okay. All right, takes. I take, of course. Queen like a rook, taking the file. Although this move allowed you to prey. That's right, prey upon my known weakness, Balbir. I can't see diagonals. As we're about to see. So best move, great. Glad I made that move. Hey, look, that's a bad move. Megan caught it. She was like, dude. Why? I thought I lost the game here. And in fact, I think I pretty much did. Plop. Great move. Yes. Okay, so I make this move. Saving the day. Lose a piece. Great. And then I make this move. A good move. But not a good move. What was I thinking here? It wants me to come there. Why? Allows the knight to control more squares. Um, this helps build pressure on the restricting the pieces, right? So which is why I did it. But you're able to easily move this. Swing. That happens. Okay, my next move, I'm pretty sure, is a blunder. It's not. It's the best move. Never mind. There was a move here where I think you could have won the game. Hold on. It wants you to move here instead. So you gobble up pieces. Okay. It wants that. Links these guys up for an attack on the king. I'm thinking that's why. Knight f5. Just trying to do something. But I'm going to get fucked. Queen kills f7. Like, this is bad news bears. All right. Oh, Twitch. Already said hello. Hello. All right. This happens. Takes... Excellent, but not the best. Now you take that shit. I take... Interesting, it wants me to take with the pawn. Right, so this is where I thought that... I thought this was it. Is that not... Oh, because my king has an out. Okay. Right? I was thinking this. Fuck, you can't move pawns this way. What? Oh shit. Duh, you just take your fucking Christ almighty. What was I thinking? Maybe this? Maybe that's what I was thinking. So then I move here. You grab the 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 knight and I move there. So it's not made, never mind. But I mean you're fucking up a shitload. <clears throat> Both down to a little over one minute. We were careful. Yeah, I mean, I'm not going to give myself the time thing, man. I appreciate the the vote of confidence. I just played like shit. <laughs> Interesting. So it does actually want you to do this, and you pick up the knight. Okay, queen trade. You knew you were up, and I fucked this up. Um, I should have advanced because this was happening. And interesting, this could have been not a draw, but what is it? Is it take? No, E3. Yeah, protect that shit. So I've got one more pawn. No, we're, we equal on pawn. You're up a piece. I'm still in the game here. Should have pushed forward. But I don't. All this is fun. But it's losing. It's all losing. Okay, let me see what are the best moves here. 
pretty much I made a bunch of excellent moves and none of the bests. I didn't want to do this because I thought this was going to happen. And it does. So what do I do? Push? Yeah, h6. So you probably come out here or even push back. e4. Probably get my king involved. f7. Yeah. I mean, you're still winning. All right. I'm going to run through the last few bits of this and we'll be good. That was a free pawn. Thanks, Keith. Could have chased your bishop. Interesting. It said that was fine. And that's a bad move. So move the knight back. Consolidate power. I thought you should have taken. It says no. Just push the pawn. Reroute to an actual position. Takes. Takes. And then we go down. Should have taken. I was going for a stalemate, but this is all lost. Okay. So, well done, Balbir. I'm going to go on a break real quick. I'm going to get some water. <laughs> 